local groups are banding together, trying to save a locally owned radio station. Cakes Kara Kumari here with a story. Kara. A local radio station known for showcasing local artists is about to go off the air, but they're hoping a Unity concert could help save the station. Which stars alternative fly 92.7. You're hanging out with Mac. That was but Mac's days of hanging out on the fly are numbered. Fly 92.7 will soon become Fiesta 92.7, and one of the last locally owned radio stations in Wichita will be signing off for good. Employees say a lack of advertisers is the reason for the format change. I know that people are out there and the support is out there, but without the advertisers, we as a station, or and they as an advertising, you know, that's what free radio is all about. The advertisers pay. The Fly is known for its alternative format and its showcase of local artists. It's something Mech believes the community needs, and he's not going away without a fight. That's why he's organized a concert featuring local bands. He wants advertisers to see there is a supportive fan base. If we can take it out on a positive note and show Wichita that there is support in the city, then we possibly can carry it on. Members of the local band Tainted were already upset about losing Fly 92.7, so they were more than happy to join the concert. It's about coming together. It's about the power of the community, the power of all of us getting together in the underground and making our voice heard. And Mech is hoping thousands of fans will come above ground and make a difference. I want to see the support, so I'm calling for 5,000 people. Some people think I'm nuts, but it's just the fact of I love the Fly. And the concert is on Saturday at JC's House of Rock. Susan?